The Custom Slideshow feature allows you to create a custom show based upon any of the slides in the original presentation. And you can see in my presentation here, I've got a total of 17. And when I give my presentation to some groups, some of them are not ready for the other slides that I have within here. For example, let's say that I have three different types of groups. I have beginner, intermediate, and advanced. Sometimes when I'm giving the presentation, in the middle of it, they're like, uh, we're not ready for that, or yeah, we already know all that. Instead of having three separate files, I can go ahead and load them all into one and be able to organize them into different custom slideshows. So to do that, again, to have one for beginner, intermediate, advanced, just come up here, click on the slideshow tab, and go to the start slideshow group, and click on custom slideshow. You can see in the pop-up it says show only the slides you choose. This is a great way to shorten your presentation or tailor it for different audiences. Just pick the slides you want to use, add them to the new show, change the slide order if necessary, and you're done. Okay, well I'll show you. Click on it, go down to custom shows, and we got nothing here but new. And then it's got a listing of all the slides within the current presentation, and this one's going to be for our beginner. And then let's keep it simple. Let's say it's the first, oh, seven slides. And then click Add, and there you go. Now notice over here that you can also reorder them. So if like the last slide in this presentation, this custom slideshow, seven, you select it and you move it up one. Notice how it still retains its original number from the original presentation, slide seven, even though now it's going to be presenting in this presentation, this custom show on slide six. So that way you can go, oh yeah, that's right, I rearranged it because originally it's supposed to be the last, well, slide in the original presentation. I mean, as far as sequentially going from 6 to 7 instead of 7 to 6. In any case, when you're done with that, go ahead and click Okie Dokie and let's do another one. Click New. This one's going to be our intermediate. And this one we'll do 8 through 12. Sounds good. Add, click Okie Dokie, click New. And this one's going to be advanced. And we'll do 13. And you can also, you know, you don't have to do it sequentially. You can just do it out and grab some from the other presentations, like your beginning and then the first slide in the intermediate case if you need to do a quick review, if those are title slides, for each of those custom presentations. And then you can click Add. And there you go. Slide 1 and slide two, but that's slide eight from the original presentation here, and then 13, 14 through 17. Great, click okie dokie, and that's it. And you can either do it from here, like, okay, let's start with the beginner, and click show, and it starts the presentation. And as you go through, if somebody says, yeah, we've seen all this, what else you got? You're like, oh, fudge, I gotta hurry and make a change. That's okay. If you got a mouse, you can right click, and then go down to custom show, and say, Ah, let's go to Intermediate. Click on that, and it begins from the first slide in that second custom show, the Intermediate. You can click and go through all that. And Let me do Control S, and you can see all the slides, the total amount of slides within the presentation. We're on slide three. Let's go ahead and click Cancel and hit the Escape key. And so when you're giving your presentation, just open up one file, and then come up here and do your custom slideshow, well, on the Slideshow tab again, to the Start Slideshow group because this slideshow that we're going to start is a custom one, and it includes all these. Now you can either go ahead and begin it by selecting one of these, Advanced, and there's the first slide in the beginner presentation, click to advance to the first slide in the second intermediate presentation, and then finally we get to the Advanced. Oh, that looks really cool. I want to go there, and there, and there. And then, in any case, let's go ahead and hit the Escape key to end it. Or you can click on the drop-down arrow, go to Custom Shows, and of course we can begin the show from there. You can also remove them, like if we want to get rid of beginner, let's remove, it's toast, it's gone, there's no, hey, bring it back. You can also edit it, make some changes, no, we'll click cancel, remove it, remove it, and then edit that. We can get rid of slide one, slide eight, click okie dokie, and you can also, if you want to make a slight variation of it, you can copy it. And then let's go ahead and with it selected, edit it, and this will be, well, it's copy of advanced, but you can call that advanced number two, and say in advanced number two, we won't go over the first few slides here, but just towards the last two, because maybe those are super detailed, and then click okie dokie, now we just have two. Of course, we can select it and show it, and, oh, look, this is for the CIA, we got our scope on the boat here, shoot the boat, no, I'm kidding. 
hit the escape key and cool. Thanks for watching. Hey, as a quick reminder, if you like my video, please give it a thumbs up. You can also click on me and subscribe to my channel to get notified of the latest videos. And for great specials on my products, please see the description below this video.